children. I pray that you heal their little heart, that you mend their heart, that you make them into men and women of standard and of value. And let them pray. And let them know that you love them. Let them know that you love them. Let them know that you love them. Let them know that their mother loves them. Let them know that their mother loves them. Let them know that their mother loves them. Let them know that their father loves them. Let them know that their father loves them. Let them know that their father loves them. And let their parents be good role models, Lord. Help them to be good role models. Help them to set a good example for them. And Lord, I bind that spirit of anger. I bind that spirit of fear. I bind that spirit of hurting. I bind that spirit of rage and that acting out spirit. Don't let the devil use them. You use them, Father. And you never save the life for no reason. You never save the life for no reason. Every life you save is for a purpose. Lord, you save them in their foolishness. You save them in their blindness. You save them when they didn't know any better. You save them and you said that they are innocent and they are not guilty. And even when they were guilty, Lord, you said free them. For they're just children, and they were born with foolishness. Lord Father, I pray that you continue to use them. I pray that you continue to deal with them. For every life you save is for a purpose. 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 You don't save the life for no reason. You don't save a life for no reason. You don't save a life for no reason. Every life you save is for a purpose. And you remember why you save that life. And you build on that. You expand on that. And you increase on that. And the Lord, we ask that you expand in the life of the children. That you increase in the life of the children. That you expand in the life of the children. Have your way with them, Lord. Let them be men and women of valor and standard. Let them be men and women who are courageous and strong. Lord, let them grow up. Let them protect them when they grow up. Let them increase. Let them multiply. Let them have friends that love them. Let them have family that care for them. Let them walk and learn and do the things that they need to do. And Lord, let me bind that disease off of them. We bind that affliction off of them. And we say that it goes back to the pit of where it came from. So, Lord, you you did not, it was not your plan for them to have diseases and infirmities. It was not your plan for them to be bound up. It was not your plan for them not, for them to be, uh, to, to have a complicated life. You gave us, you gave, you wanted to give us life, life abundantly. And, it, and we can have that in your son. You want to heal us and heal us abundantly. And we can have that in your son. You wanted to save us, Lord, save us and save us abundantly. You wanted to keep us abundantly. And we can through your son. But Lord, there's just children right now. They don't know any better. They don't know how to walk up here. Help the parents to train them. Help the parents to show them love. Help the parents show that they care for them. Help the parents to build them up that they may walk before you in the beauty of holiness. In Jesus' name.